Hi everyone, this is South Brown. I recently watched a video by Tracy, who's at Made With Love Creations. She did a video on all of her Tim Holtz products, and she challenged anyone else that was brave enough. I left Tracy a comment and told her I wish she had done this video earlier in the day because I'm kind of like burnt out tired because I was doing um, yard work but I thought about it and thought about it and I want to go ahead and do the video so what you're looking at now is um, the new paper pad by Tim Holtz this is my favorite um, paper pad that he has come out with it is one of my favorites I surprisingly I only have three of his paper packs and it is this craft one which I will be getting another one and the paper stash the lost and found and the paper stash the seasonal and I actually got the seasonal one on clearance for um, I think it was $4.99 but those are all the papers of Tim Holtz that I own yeah, I know. A big surprise with all the other paper that I have. But I just don't find his paper to be appealing. But this paper right here is my all-time favorite. Oh my God, I love this paper. But anyway, I'll go ahead and move on. And like Tracy said, do not judge her. Tracy, I am not judging you because with all the things all the stuff that we all have nobody can judge anybody and I am not judging you so I hope that no one judge me but I don't care if you do because this is what I like and it's what I do so here is my stash I have a lot of I want to say a lot of but I have a few of these alcohol ink applicators and the alcohol ink applicator felt pads and also some of the blending foam pads and you guys I probably should not be one of the ones buying any of this stuff because the only I've only done I think two projects that I included any of Tim Holtz projects um, products but nonetheless I do love his products I have one of his his um, stamp sets I did not know that this came as a part of this one and you guys have seen that I have a few of his um, stamp sets and you saw probably in a video last year where I took them out and I put them in CD cases so this is where I have those and I also have some of his loose ones sorry about that glare but I have some of his loose ones that he had but these are his stamp sets we'll move over to his embossing powders I have all of the embossing powders the old collection except for one I have every single pad of his Distress ink pads. I have every single one. I have a few of his crackle paints. I have a few of his alcohol inks. A few of his distress stickles. And I have all of the distress ink refills, I think, except one or two. I think there's 24 of these. I don't know if he's come out with all of. Um, any of the new colors and I have all of his die um, big dies I think I'm missing one of the on the edge and this is the mini Baroque and I have his keyholes and the uh, movers and shapers no this is the mini baroque this one is i think these are the keyholes 
I have only one of his new dies, and this is the sewing room. But I have all of his older dies. I have all of them. Except for one. I don't have the flourishes one. And I've been trying to find that one at a lower price. But I have not been able to find it. Every time I find it, it's still like regular price. And there's not a coupon where I can use in store. And I have some of his fragments. I've used these a couple times. And I have... This is the only um, alterations texture fades. Actually, I have two. I have this. Well, this is a new one. And this is from the old collection. This is the only one that I have from the old collection. And this is the notebook and the collage. I have his strips, alteration strips. And I have some of his grunge board. I don't really use too much of the grunge board. And I have some of his masks. Well, I have all of the old masks. I have some of his tissue tape. I have his charm clips. These are the new ones. These are the new charm clips. There's another mask. I have his baubles. I have his a Dodge tickets and journaling tickets. And I have um, long fasteners, time pieces, more Adage tickets. I have two sets of his conic scissors. I have his scratcher and his um, pick. And I also have um, his hardware. Unlike Tracy, I was able to take mine out of the packaging. I just find that it's easier to have to, you know, look for what I want and not have to worry about closing and opening the package. So I have all of the smaller ones here. And in this one, I have all of the big ones. Like I have his ornate plates here, the D-rings, his memo pens. I have his keys, the film strip, word sticks, hinge clips, and some more time pieces that are here. But that is my Tim Holtz collection. And if you guys remember, I did this layout using his ornate plate and one of his memo pens and one of his adage tickets. This is one of the projects that I did using his products and the other product I I mean the other project that I did was a tag that I sent to my girl Regina over at All Things Pretty 2 I'm um, Pretty 3 and that's it this is all my Tim Holtz stash that's all I have And like I said, I will be going back to get this paper pad right here. I just love this paper pad. This is by far the fav my favorite of his. I guess it's because of the craft paper. But I love this paper. I'm going to be surprised if I get two more. All right, you guys. That's my Tim Holtz stash. Thanks for watching. Bye.